hello guys welcome to my channel it's on tutorial in this video we are discuss about assignment 9 solution of municipal solid waste management here you can see that the first question is what are the location restriction that must be considered for landfill site first 300 meter away from highway second 500 meter from water supply third 400 meter away from public park and fourth 10 meter from pond so the explanation of question number first is here location restriction is 20 km away from airport 200 meter away from highway 500 meter from habitation 300 meter from public park 500 meter from water supply 200 meter from pond and 100 meter from river so the correct answer is question number first is option number b 500 meter from water supply so question number second secured landfill is for disposal of first municipal solid waste second plastic waste third hazardous hazardous waste fourth construction and demolition waste so the explanation of question number second is here landfill secured landfill for the disposal of hazardous waste so the correct answer is question number second is option number c hazardous hazardous waste question number third active period of sanitary landfill typically is less than 15 years greater than 35 years 20 to 25 years 15 to 20 years so the explanation of question number third is here active period may typically range from 20 to 25 years depending on the availability of land area so the correct answer is question number third is option number c 20 25 years question number four what type of waste is suitable for sanitary landfill first non-biodegradable waste second non dust waste third inert, inert waste fourth all of these so the explanation of question number four is here waste category suitable for sanitary landfill are the following first non biodegradable and inert waste second common clay waste third pre-processing and post-processing reject from waste processing site fourth non hazardous waste not being proceed here is recycled so the correct answer is question number four is option number d all of the above Question number five, which component of a landfill prevent disease carrying vector from entering the landfill? First lift, second cell, third daily cover, fourth final lift. So the explanation of question number five is here. Daily cover consists of six to twelve in of a native or alternative material such as compost that are applied in the working phase of the landfill at the end of the each operating period. It controls the blowing of the waste material, entry of water and prevent disease, prevent disease vector from entering the landfill. So the correct answer is question number 5 is option number C, daily cover. Question number 6, which of the following landfilling method can be used when ground water table is high? First trench method, second area method, third ex excavate method, fourth canoin method. So the explanation of question number 6 is here. Area method. Area method is when the terrain is unstable for excavation such when the ground water table is high. So the correct answer is question number 6 is option number B. Area method. Question number 7. What is the main gas responsible for landfill fire? First carbon dioxide, second methane, third ammonia, fourth carbon monoxide. So the explanation of question number 5 is here. Question number 7. The waste dumped could catch fire and pollute the atmosphere methane gas produced as a result. So the correct answer is question number 7 is option number B methane gas. Question number 8. Selection of the best ranked sites for of landfill is done based on Pollution load index, solvita index, site sensitivity index, 
bioaccumulation index so the explanation of question number 8 is here selection of best ranked site the selection of most appropriate site based on the site sensitivity index based on the guideline given so the correct answer is question number 8 is option number c site sensitivity index we will meet in the next video thank you guys